Hey guys, um, welcome back to my channel. So today I just have like a really super super chill vlog um, about math, which is kind of funny. Um, and just kind of like my experience in math like as a high schooler um, while I'm doing some math homework because I have a pretty math heavy night ahead of me, which I will show you. Um, I have a calculus quiz tomorrow. And it's not that I don't know how to do it, it's like almost that I'm just scared to do it and that's kind of a feeling that like math just loves to bring out um I just want to talk about like my math journey like I used to really pff, hate math suck at math felt like it was the hardest thing ever um I took algebra one and I I didn't fail the class but it wasn't my best moment um if you know what I mean. I worked super hard at geometry and I like really surprised myself by like getting A's in that class. Um, so then I kind of felt like maybe I had this thing wrong. Um, but I never truly felt that way. Algebra 2 was not good for me. I really felt that that math challenged me and I was very scared of that math. Um, I'm not typically an algebra person, I guess, is what I learned. Um, looking back on it now, it's like not as hard as I was thinking it was, but also that's because I've done more years of math. Um, but like somehow I managed to scrape by an A in that class. It was just like, took up a lot of my mental space. Pre-calc in junior year, it was a little more chill. I felt like I kind of understood things better. Calc is fun. It is fun. It's just sometimes it can be a lot and I feel like that's okay and it's okay not to be like inherently good at math like some other kids are. Like I know that I have to work extra hard at this stuff. If you're scared of math or you feel like you can't do it, it's possible that you can and it just honestly takes practice and that's okay and you don't have to be good at it the first try or like the second try or really any try as long as you're like doing your best and I know that's like kind of cheesy but it's true and I like to remind myself of that when I'm doing work like this that is hard and I it's eight questions and it's taken me an hour that was just my little little very chill vlog um speech I'm going to do some work now and um Hopefully this can make you feel a little more productive, especially if you're maybe like procrastinating math, which is was definitely me earlier. And yeah. Also, like a little tip I have is sometimes if I don't recommend always working in your bed, but if you're sitting in your bed and you figure maybe I should try to get some work done, sometimes being cozy just helps you like focus a little better or even like feel more comforted while you're doing things that make you uncomfortable, obviously, which for me sometimes is math. So in a little blanket and listening to some lo-fi and maybe even lighting a candle which i might do soon is is helpful and like to have a pet around like my cat um while i try to absorb information It is um, quite late for a school night, but I was able to get a lot of things off my to-do list done. 
um, and my math. Um, it wasn't so bad once I started doing the problems. I rememorized the unit circle and I can now do it in under a minute, except it's kind of crazy looking, it looks like this. I think I'm gonna review it one more time before I go to bed. Um, but other than that, I mostly understand how to do these problems. But yeah, I'm glad that I kind of reminded myself that I can do hard things, especially when it comes to math. So I think it's time I say goodnight. Um, thanks for watching. Bye!